Good morning from Munich Airport and welcome to a new video. Today I'm flying for the first time with Top Portugal. I'm going to Lisbon on the A320 Neo. I booked the cheapest possible fare for this flight. I paid 58 euros from Munich to Lisbon and then Lisbon to Porto. During the online check-in I got a random aisle seat and I was also not able to change it at the airport check-in. By the way, my flight was the very first leaving from Munich this morning. Departure time was 6.05 a.m. Okay, that took a bit longer than expected. I managed for security now. And lounges here at Munich open at 5 a.m. It's currently uh, 4.50. So let's see if the lounge is already open. This day I was visiting the Lufthansa Senator Cafe for the first time. It's the smallest lounge at Munich Airport and you get access with the Starlines Gold status or if you're flying in first class. It's rather small, there's only capacity for around 30 guests and the food they offer here is a bit different than to the food they offer in the Senator lounges. I felt really welcome in this lounge and I was very satisfied with the food and the service. Okay, this Lufthansa Senato Cafe really exceeded my expectations. Um, it's really small and it feels really exclusive. And the catering is really good. Um, it's everything is like in the Mediterranean style. Um, and yeah, boarding should have started 8 minutes ago, according to my boarding pass, which I do not believe. But let's go to the gate now. And something else which was really cool. They were finally able to uh, change my seat to a window seat. And it's even a 7th row, which means um, I may have like more leg room and even a headrest and which I'll see now when we start boarding. My aircraft for this flight is this two and a half year old Airbus A320neo. Okay, let's see how My seat for this flight is 7F, it's the first row of economy right behind the business class. The seats in the front rows offer a better legroom and also come with headrests. So if you can, you should definitely aim for these seats. My luggage also made it on board. I checked it the day before because I was at the airport anyways and so I didn't have to carry it in the morning. Our flight time for today is exactly 3 hours. The leg room here was really good and it made the flight so comfortable. Something else I liked was that the seats were equipped with USB and also universal power outlets. And those seats also came with tablet holders. And as mentioned earlier, the seats also came with headrests, so seat-wise this flight was actually pretty comfortable. However, TUP doesn't offer any complimentary service on this 3 hour flight. TUP introduced a buy on board service like many other European carriers. A sandwich, drink and snack costs 11 euros and lasagna, drink and snack costs 11.50 for example. On my flight they offered a breakfast menu, they charged 5 euros for a warm drink and a snack. I was super tired on this flight. I had a short nap and when I woke up we were already coming closer to Lisbon. My experience on board was good, the seat was comfortable and as mentioned earlier I didn't really pay a lot for this flight. So the value I got for my money was actually quite okay. And that's everything from my side and now please enjoy the landing at Lisbon Humberto Delgado Airport. Once 
welcome to Lisbon, the capital of Portugal. I want to thank you very much for watching the video until the end. I hope you enjoyed the review and if you did so, please leave a like on this video and subscribe to the channel. I am about to hit 1000 subscribers and I hope to achieve this number really soon. Have a great week and see you again in two weeks for the next video.